all right so one of the more outshining characters that have returned from the sheer hero collab is definitely not fumi as he has been a god tier support for chaos arthur pretty much allowing you to increase the damage dealt for your humans and he also gets his max hp increase per human that's on the field let alone being a good base stat booster for the humans once he throws up his stance again a really solid solid character for Karis arthur so we're gonna be using it and in pvp i'm um, using a more fun setup as you're gonna be using green hawk oslo now if you don't know green hawk oslo do give 50 percent of defense to all allies and then with his new holy rally he gives 15 percent hp that's pretty much what all it does it just gives 15 percent hp so he can work pretty well with nafumi and Karis arthur by giving that 15 percent hp as well too um again i have been seeing a lot of people run some very interesting setups with chaos arthur with the nafumi some people even use sr list you know the red one um i don't know if you guys remember like back in the good old days you used to use this red sr list just so you can recover a lot of hp back um again people have been using this character a lot lately too again pretty annoying when you're pairing this long chaos arthur just because you have that taunt function but hopefully you guys enjoyed the video um, comment down below are you summoning on the new sheer hero collab or are you saving for an anniversary all right let's see what we got here a astros the team featuring gelda um let's see how this goes now again they want to try to clear my nafumi stance which is going to be uh unfortunate for me i'm really debating if i should use dodge food for this type of team just because again if they clear it off when we stance, then I'm pretty much uh, over with. Yeah, it's pretty much what they about to do. It looks like what's about to happen right now. And he put red time your length on his Acerosa. I guess we can only hope that he has no Cars with Melly. That's the only thing we can hope for right now. Because if not, if I did nothing, then he would just encroach me. So let's see what we can do. Oh, this man's debating. No, st okay, no. Cl Dance clear, huh? Okay. That's actually really good for me. Um, so that means he had no cards. So we definitely got to get rid of you. And then we just hopefully finish you off right here at the same time. Hopefully it's enough damage. It is. But that didn't kill. <laughs> that was enough damage though, unfortunately. We have a uh, Chaos Arthur Ultimate, which is really nice. But unfortunately I didn't pull a, a stance card or something. So I wonder if he's going to just single target blast me right here. Now Fumi is gone. All right, so hopefully not. Hopefully Kara starts to tank this. Oh, it's gonna be close. All right, he tanked it. Yeah, GG. GG. What a close one, man. What a close one. I think I might use dodge food just because the Gelda Demon Team is a little bit troublesome. The Gelda Demon Team is definitely a little bit too troublesome for me. Hopefully it's enough damage right here. Oh my god, I got scared. I got scared. I ain't gonna lie. I got scared. I'm like, ain't no way. I'm just sitting there like, ain't no way.
right. Pretty much gonna finish me off. Yeah, GG. Woo! Man, those demon teams a little bit scary though. All right, we got the demon gilded team. All right, so we go for this then. And I guess we can just end up marking Melly. So he's just gonna mark Melly right here. I am using dodge food. So keep that in mind. It's just that I've kept facing a lot of demons. So if I use dodge food, that could like at least stop them from encroach my chaos archer very frequent frequently. All right, so we go for this then, and this as well. Let's go for another stance. Ooh, and the damage is just so so good. The damage is just so good. Now we have Karis Arthur Ultimates right here, but unfortunately we don't have um. Yeah, I saw that coming. We don't have another stance for now for me, so I can increase my damage dealt. I guess what I could do right here is just um, just ult normally, and um, uh, I guess mark with Bon. It's still gonna hit pretty hard, my ultimate. Hopefully it's enough. Ooh, 369. Yeah, GG. GG, my boy. All right, we have a Nafumi Kiara start the team. All right. And I guess we can just go for this as well. Cause you're just AOEing right here anyways. A okay, really good damage. And we got the four stacks. Ooh, ooh, a silver stance too. Silver stance is really nice. Hopefully, um, <laughs> not fool me. The tank though, these hits. At the Guinness stance. So that'd be the big issue is if he can tank those hits afterwards. All right, let's get rid of um, Bond real quick. Oh, I should have got Rikaya's Arthur. It looked like I could have. Forge of 44k. It looked like I could have did enough damage. I guess I can check my HP on Kiaris Arthur after this though. But I should have a whole bunch of HP, especially because I have my stand still up. Yep. All right, let's see my HP. 843, really good. So we go for this, uh, this, and I guess this as well. Just to finish you off. Cause I did force revive on you already. Let's see, not fool me. Eight hundred seventy-eight. Golly. And see ya. See ya, my boy. All right, we have a Victoria, Gother, and Hell team. Kind of the more metal team, if you want to use the unknown team, because you know um, they use rank ups. But don't tell, don't tell people in the comments. I'll tell you how much uh, people don't use rank ups. 
He's about to rank up to um Victoria pretty soon. He's actually about to rank up too. That's why he's saving up his cards for a uh, a rainy day. So I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put it on hail. Just because I already know this guy's gonna rank up. Just remember, uh, if he ranks up, he cleanses. So I'm just gonna put it on hail. Uh, let's see what he's gonna go for. Yep, it's on Fatoria for her AoE, which we had dodge food, so he doesn't even get his uh full boost, boosted damage because we had dodge food. All right, he got rid of a uh, bond, which is fine. Or should I just go for this and stuff? Just to guarantee the the wipe. Cause they is cause Fatoria is blue, so like she's gone regardless. So GG my boy. GG. All right, we have a demon team 421 remember i'm using dodge food because i'm most likely going to get out cc using this type of team because i'm using hawk oslo so let's see what we can do okay the aoe's He always multiple times, so he's gonna get his boost literally next turn, huh? He's gonna get his boost next turn, and he's real time your link on. All right, this only thing I can think of doing right now. Let's do this on Demi King real quick. Just so he can crit. Okay, he has one card to his name, which I'm assuming is going to be a single target since he hasn't used it yet. It looks like Demon King is about to go for his AoE. But you got to be very careful because Bond does have five gauge. And what I can do afterwards is just triple spam my AoEs with um Arthur. Looks like you about to go for the encroachment, but I do cleanse this as well. So, oh, okay. He sees that I was going to have my ultimate. Smart, smart. I'm gonna say like, cause I was gonna have my ultimate pretty soon. So, GG. I'm sitting here like, is he gonna just let me get my ultimate? But at least he's smart enough to know. But um, if he would have got rid of Arthur, he would have had to face Bond's ultimate at the end. So GG regardless, my guy. He just had bad RNG. Because he could have just probably like tried to go heavy on Arthur or something like that. But because I have 5 gauge on Bond, he just knows like, okay, he's going to be done for. Okay, this man literally can't do anything. All right, see you, my boy. At least you, I hope you feel good, though. You're 420k with demons. That's cool. That's cool, though. Didn't save you, but pretty cool. All right, what we got here? This man's name is Gas Monkey. That's kind of crazy. This is going to be my last match anyways. Uh, hopefully we can see the silver stance on Nafumi because I have not checked it. I might have to do some other matches to see my defense with Nafumi. But I can show you guys without the stance and all the good stuff. Oh, he just, okay, he just spammed. 
This man just did not care. He just said, yo, I need that queen blessing boost. So this is not for me uh, at 40K. All right, let's go for this then. Now, the reason why I did it on hell is because they always, and I kid you, always rank up Fatoria. So I'm just gonna put it on hell. And he gets a silver rank up. Oh my god, of course. Hopefully, it's not a gold card or anything it's too crazy. Ooh, Vaughn might be gone though. Hopefully, Bond is not gone. That's right, though, because um, since I'm using a Nafumi team, ooh, we got the Silver Stance. I would say since I'm using a Nafumi team, we can technically see um how powerful we are because we can get the counter is hell no matter what. So let's do this. You're gone. I know I'm debuffed crazy, but this he's in hell, uh, he can't target me until he gets through now for me. And he won't get through now for me because <laughs> now for me is the one rocking red to RBO link too. He goes for another rank up. Oh my God, you rank up crazy. And people say rank up is not good on unknown. This man is rank up crazy. Okay. He AoEs again. Okay. All right. So you guys can see his, um, just so you guys can see our defense stats, 67 K. And then was this hell red time link? No, she wasn't. All right, I'm just going for this then. Now for me card and then just finish it off like this. I should have just ended off with Hawk Oslo, just a troll. 1.1 million. Golly. Well, at least um, we popped off. Yeah, GG, my boy. So, hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. We'll be using Nafumi with Green Hawk Oslo. Again, it was pretty fun. Um, obviously, uh, it's not the best in terms of CC. And again, this is gear PP. So, anything can happen. Like, especially if you face off against Demon Teams, anything can happen. But, hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys like and subscribe again. This really, guys, I'm out. Peace.